Hello everyone! In celebration of Cinco de Mayo, I wanted to give you a little bit of history of the holiday. Let me put my glasses on. Americans everywhere will be drinking margaritas and eating chips and salsa, but what is the Mexican holiday really about and what exactly are we celebrating? Cinco de Mayo, Spanish for the 5th of May, is an annual celebration held in Mexico on May 5th. The day is observed to commemorate the Mexican army's victory over the French Empire at the Battle of Puebla on May 5th, 1862. Under the leadership of General Ignacio Zaragoza, the victory of the smaller Mexican force against a larger French force was a boost to morale for the Mexicans Zaragoza died months after the battle due to illness. A year after the battle, a larger French force defeated the Mexican army at the Second Battle of Puebla, and Mexico City soon fell to invaders. In the United States, Cinco de Mayo has taken on a significance beyond that in Mexico, more popularly celebrated in the United States and Mexico. The day has become associated with the celebration of Mexican American culture. These celebrations began in California where they have been observed annually since 1863. The day gained nationwide popularity in the 1980s thanks especially to advertising campaigns by beer and wine companies. Today Cinco de Mayo generates beer sales on par with the Super Bowl, wow. In Mexico, the commemoration of the battle continues to be mostly ceremonial, such as through military parades or battle reenactments. Cinco de Mayo is sometimes mistaken for Mexico's Independence Day, the most important national holiday in Mexico, which is celebrated on September 16th. So now you know, everybody, today is not Independence Day for Mexico. <laughs> <laughs> well, at least some people have studied a little bit about Mexico and they know the actual um, significance of the holiday. But, you know, like I say, an excuse to drink. Hey, the United States had made, made it popular because of beer and wine. So, chips and salsa on the 5th and margaritas taste good. All right, everybody, I hope you enjoyed my little history on Cinco de Mayo. Until then, bye-bye.